Hi guys, welcome back. Another Wednesday, another shave, and here we are. It's tube time again, <laughs> and we've got some new stuff in the den. So without further ado, let's crack on, and I'll show you. First new item for me, check that out. That's the Razor Rock, it says it on the bottom, but it may be very thin. Razor Rock 400 Noir. And it's called a Noir because of that black knot. And it's a limited edition, 24 millimeter black knot. And that is, um, I can't think of anything to bang it against. But uh, it's uh, heavy, quite a heavy beast. It's metal, it feel, it's aluminium, not aluminium. But there you go. And that, and we'll get that in some warm water. Get that brush soaking. Uh, second use today. And then it'll be dismantled and packed away, ready to go back to Mark. The Razor Rock Game Changer. Wasn't going to use this today, was going to use another one. But got in from work late. I've literally been in 10 minutes. I've just got so much to do. Got in from work late. Didn't have time to get the blades ready. I'll tell you a bit more about that on Saturday. But I'm looking forward to using that on Saturday morning so for today we're going to second crack at the game changer and I've put the blade that was in it the green astro blade I put that back in so it'll be the second use on that um, and I tend not to use them more than that so that'll be going I'll get that in the water in the cup of water there with the brush the tube we're going to be using check this out guys imperial leather Imperial leather boots the chemist cool cologne. I don't know why I said imperial leather boots the chemist cool cologne. We'll get some in the official John Shades bowl. Look at that. There you go. Oh my word, that smells. Do you know what? It does smell like a cologne. Oh, that smells fantastic. We forward to using that and then I've got Donny and the next stick on standby hopefully we won't need them I'm going to balm up with this bit of pore shave and the reason I've chosen that is because that smells I don't know if it's because of that you see uh Rassage. I don't know if I say it's got a European ingredient in it that I'm not aware of or something but it smells very similar to one of the aftershaves I'm going to be using and here they are guys, there you go, everybody's using them, Hager from Sweden, we've got the Uppsala and we've got the original, one of them smells like plastic, one of them doesn't, I thought it was the bottle, but I decanted them both into the glass and 24 hours later, uh, it still smells of plastic and the other one doesn't and never has, so it may well be just that that's just the scent, but I'm looking forward to using those two, Hager. Thank you to the DC Shaves for those. Okay, let's crack on with this shave, guys. Let's get this, oh, let's get this mush wet. I want to give a shout out to Bradley. How's it going, Bradley? Take it easy, buddy. Whew. Uh, yeah, right. I'm looking forward, I've seen people using these brushes. And often thought I'm going to get one of them. It's a hefty beast, guys. We're in the water out. I can tell you right now that knot's got a good bit of backbone. A really good. Let's... Oh yes, yes. Well, look. Let's have a look and see that cream. That tube's been sat in there. I would say for the best part of a year because I've just had so much to get through. They could take a bit more water. I've just had so much to get through. I've not. That's why I did this tube Wednesday to try and get through. I think I've got three tubes left to go. Uh, two tubes left to go in there now, and then we can start moving on and get get some of these uh, soaps on the go. Okay, so there you go. Mm. Hasn't lathered the greatest, guys. I'll be honest with you, but. Um, yeah, I can say, what was it, a pound? Okay, here we go, I love, I love this handle, I love it, that, that, that um, lip there, sort of like just, oh yeah, wow, look at that guys, oh, 
well you can't complain about the lather can you it doesn't smell the smell isn't the greatest i would say about a four four out of ten but you can't argue with this lather can you Hmm. the brush is performing as well look at that okay wow look at that guys that's quite a thick shiny lather isn't it here we go second use razor rock game changer thanks to mark look at that look look what are like those women on the postcards you know when they've got the cherry lipstick lips on like i'm going okay here we go first grab now how has everyone been doing? I've had a pretty good week at work, but oh, I've gone over the 400 subscriber mark. Uh, I put the feelers out, I've only sat on 399 for a couple of days now, guys. Can anyone get me to 400? And about a dozen people, was, what, eight or nine, I think I'm on 308 or 408 or 409 right now. So I got over that 400. So if you're not already a subscriber, please click like and subscribe. Anyway, let's get back to this. I am liking this game changer. Look at that. Shave him with the right hand. I am a lefty. So, what we're going to talk about? Well, I tell you a little bit about my ethos and my approach towards wet shaving. No. I think we're all just one big family, so to speak, if you like, in the wet shaving. One big community, aren't we? And what communities do is you help each other. There's no rivalry. I'm not trying to rival anybody. As a matter of fact, I've quite often mentioned other channels on here like uh, back in the day i may have mentioned shave 326 dave from dave shaves uh, i mentioned i am cdb market friendship shaving paul humphreys flash board and i mentioned them all the time other shaving channels there's no rivalry my philosophy is that of i am cdb that you know, a rising tide lifts all ships, doesn't it? If this community grows, and we grow, and our channels grow, and more people watch, and more people... Then that's, that's better for everybody, isn't it? So, I don't see any shame whatsoever at all. In saying, you know, hey guys, if you're not subscribers, you know, on the forums and the Facebook groups and so on, if you're not subscribers, guys, will you give us a sub? But I did that. And uh, someone took offence and said it was tacky and cheap uh, and they, they wouldn't do it. Well, you know, we're all different, aren't we? I don't think it's tacky or cheap. I don't see anything wrong with it. I mean, I post my videos, I post my shaves of the day. I post my video links. Everybody's happy with that in all the forums and so on. I don't think there's anything wrong with saying any chance of a sub, guys. 
So I'd just like to say out there to Mark at Friendship Shaving or Paul Paul H Films, these have got these guys have got forums. I don't need to say it with a rich man. Because the rich man family is all about helping people and helping each other up. When this kind of thing is openly embraced and welcomed. But in a couple of the other forums, I've done it. I just want to, so I don't need to say to Rich, if you're offended, I apologize, because I know Rich isn't. But I would say to Mark, at Mark at Friendship Shaving, to be honest, I, don't think, I know Mark isn't either. Uh, and to Paul Humphreys. Or anybody else. If you're offended by me going on a shaving forum and asking for subs, there's nothing I can do about that. Just know it's not my intention to offend anybody. Nobody has ever said, you know, from the forums. It's a bit wrong there, John. It's a bit. Of, I've seen other people doing it, you know. So yeah, that's that. Uh, yeah. So that's just where I stand. I believe, like, if I had a forum, I wouldn't. It wouldn't bother me in the slightest. If anyone came and said, look, I've got a YouTube channel, any chance of some subs? Go for it, yeah, you know. There's no rivalry. No rivalry whatsoever at all. I mean, all the differences in these channels and, and we all help each other. I mean, I got that from Market Friendship Shaving, Razor Rock Game Changer. Um, so, we all seem to want to help each other. Oh, so... If I've inadvertently offended anybody by doing that, I apologise. And if it's a problem, please tell me to stop. And I will stop. But here we go. This brush, guys. I'm going to do lather mittens a lot. This brush is fantastic. It's got quite a bit of backbone to it. But yet, when it takes on the water... Look at that, another fantastic shape. When it takes on the water, guys, I'll show you in a minute. It goes up in. Takes it, goes super duper soft. Really is a good brush. I like that brush. Okay, pick up time. So, please let me know what your shades of the day are. I do like reading them. What I'll do is I've got I've got another Zoom meeting this evening, but this one is not going to be a long one. Last night it was over two hours long. This one's going to be about 15, 20 minutes. So I'll make myself a cup of tea later on. And I sit down and I go through all the comments. I love it. I love reading your shares of the day. Oh. There you go. Look at that. Brilliant. Super duper. Super, oh, super smooth shave. Oh man, I've lost a chin. It's no good, is it? Nothing else has disappeared. Gigantic rear end, a big gigantic belly. But, uh, you know, love shaving, I've lost a chin. Oh. Anyway, here we go. Right, I'm gonna go with the original. I'm going to go with them both, actually. Hager, there you go. Oh, yeah, that's the that's the plasticky one. I mean, it really... I think there's an ingredient in there. Oh, my word. That was too much. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Oh. oh, I don't think I'll be using this again. No, no guys, I'm sorry. 
I don't mean to upset, hurt or offend anybody or belittle the product itself. It's just not for me, that. Looks like, oh, I'm getting plastic, yeah. Oh, my word. Um, DC, you can have these back. All right, let's try this one. This is the Uppsala. I think this has got cedar wood in it. See, that, that smells a bit... Bit fresher. Oh no, no. Oh my word. I thought it was called toxic waste because of the colour. Oh no, <laughs> maybe not. Oh my word. Yeah, the lid will be going back on. Uh well, I think I've just found my 500 subscriber giveaway, guys. Okay. Oh, let's get some balm on these chops. That was a good shave today, wasn't it? Thanks for all your views. Get that in there. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, my word. It's not my day today, is it? Oh, look at this. Okay, please click like and subscribe. Thanks for joining me. Thanks to everybody. The status quo would say all over the world. We're rocking tonight. Oh yes. Look at that. No weepers, no creepers. There was a couple on the last razor up, but that was that was me. Um I when I put the blade in tonight. I made sure, I don't think, after the last shave, I kind of glanced at it, I don't think that razor, that blade was sat right, but when I put it back in tonight, I made sure it was sat right. Superb shave, superb razor, and superb company from you guys. It's been brilliant. I love making these videos. I love the fact that you've watched them and comment as well. Um, take it easy, everybody. I will see you on Saturday, got a lovely razor rack lined up, courtesy of Mark again, Friendship Shaving. And we've got, hopefully, hopefully we'll have a surprise on the soap front as well. So we'll see you Saturday for the weekend shave. Take it easy, stay safe, see you Saturday.